you'll feel incomplete with your life if you don't watch it. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> wow. All right, then. Without giving too much away, what can we expect from season two? Um, I think season two is just like a bigger, better version of season one. We, um, we've definitely stepped up the game. I mean, the writers, the producers, everything, you know, hair, makeup, dance, singing. Um, mm. We've got our new songs are great. They're um, much sort of poppier, more mm. upbeat. Um, and so that's what there's a lot more dancing um, and group numbers, which is really exciting. It's kind of nice because it takes we take you off straight from the end of season one. So the audience hasn't really missed anything. Yeah. They haven't missed any sort of... Um, development between relationships or any characters you know any character growth they're just sort of they're, they're following us straight from the end of season one so it's nice that they get to see the rest of the, the characters journey yeah. and we've got a lot of new characters as well um, we've got uh, Alex who's played by Mia Jenkins who's one of our new mains um, and she comes in and sort of stirs up the mystery side of the lodge um, which is really exciting we've got about five more guest stars so yeah. It's all very exciting. That brings me to our next question. Mm. Will there be any special guest appearances in season two? Uh, yeah, so I mean, yeah, we have, you. yeah, we have um, Dove Cameron who guest stars in Four Eps, um, which was really exciting. You know, full on Disney star coming into our our show. Mm -hmm. um, so she plays a character called Jess, who comes in at the end of the season, and her character is really integral to the storyline and helps us sort of sum up the end of season two. Um, can't really say much without giving it away, yeah. but. Um, <laughs> She's definitely fun. Yeah. And then we've got Jake. Yeah. Yeah, Jake Mitchell, who is guest starring one of the episodes. Um, he's a YouTuber, so we learned a lot about that on set. Yeah, that was cool. Yeah. Uh, who else we got? Uh, Lena. Oh yeah, go on. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I mean, we, we said it before. Unfortunately, that her storyline centres more around Jade's character um, in the music school. So we didn't get many scenes and time to work with her. But when we were chilling in the green room, you know, we got to chat, got to know each other, different people, which was really nice. Actually, I think everyone slotted into the family so well. Yeah, I definitely. think that happened with Lena as well. Lena yeah. Strahl, who plays Frankie, um, who whose character goes to music school with Jade. Again, all of her scenes mm. with her, but we, I got to spend loads of time with her. It's yeah, a way exactly. to think that we had no scenes with her. <laughs> what do you love most about your characters? Um, oh, that's a hard one. I think, <laughs> listen, because there's too much. Yeah. <laughs> the opposite, no. um, I think... My favourite thing about Josh is probably also my least favourite, and I think the fact that he's so happy and bubbly all the time, and like he's amazing to play, and it requires so much energy. So yeah. like, at six o'clock in the morning, when you have no energy, it kind of <laughs> it's a real uh, challenge. But I mean, it's so much fun, and it's especially fun in the big group scenes with everyone else. Yeah. Because he keeps just dotting around, you know, talks to everyone, and is always yeah. up and happy. It's, yeah. But like Josh is really different to you as well. Yeah. The character. Yeah. Like I you're always... very laid back, and he's kind of no, no. buzzy in his face. <laughs> well, he's in your face so, all the yeah. time. Yeah. But it's kind of nice. Yeah. I guess that's nice for you to play. That's something yeah. That's so different. yeah. It's always nice to play something completely different to yourself than just you. Um, I really like Sky generally. I think she's a really cool character. But um, I think Jen, um, probably her positivity is what I like most. She's um, always sees the best in people and. You know, her heart is, is, she's so pure, like, she's, she's always wanting to help people and, 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 you know, help other people be successful. Um, she's quite selfless and I really admire that. I think that's sort of similar to me, that's kind of what Ben and Sky share, really. Yeah. That's what, what the friendship and, you know, what, what attracts Ben to Sky um, is Ben's such a caring uh, guy, he sort of, he will always put everyone else, everyone else first, even if there's, you know, some characters that he maybe not not so keen on at first. He, he can um, put aside their differences and, um, you know, because it, just because he cares so much. Do you ever dress like your characters when you're not on set? I used yeah. to have, like, a few check shirts, actually, before before I started this job, before I started season one, but then... The roasting began. Yeah, and then it sort of became a running joke that I'd always wear a check shirt, and it even got put into the script at some yeah. point. Um, so I had to get rid of all the check shirts, just to, you know... <laughs> Make that difference. Yeah, so that there was definitely a difference between Luke and Ben. Um, but I guess, like, Ben wears a pair of... Com like, we'll chuck on a pair of Converse and... Cons? Yeah, so, I, so some, maybe a few bits, a few bits of wardrobe. I don't think I wear anything Sky wears. Um, quite different styles, I think. But um, you know, Sky's is really fresh. It's really bright. It, it really matches her personality. She's got a bit of glitter, and she yeah. likes a pair of glittery trainers. That's true. Um, 
Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, no, I don't. I think I dress like the complete polar opposite to Josh. He's got some cool bomber <laughs> jackets, though, hasn't he? He's got some cool jackets. He just wears lots of hats. bright colours yeah. and hats and yeah. stuff. And you wear a lot of hats. Yeah, I do. You wore a lot of hats recently. Not like those kind of hats. Color. Not the bright hats. Yeah. But, um, like a beanie. Yeah. yeah. Maybe Josh needs to get the specs in season. I think yeah. he does. This is why I'm trying to put them on now. You know, okay. Ideas. Just get them nice. in. Nice. Yeah. Get them in. <laughs> Give us three reasons why we need to watch season two. Mm. <laughs> I was going to say you learn so much more about each individual character. Um, I think in this season, definitely everyone's going to be able to find mm -hmm. stuff they relate to in literally every single character. Yeah. I think it's just really fun. Like you're definitely going to enjoy watching. You know, you're going to want to boogie and um, and it's really it's really um, invested in into the characters. Um, if you rested in season one, it, the season two will definitely keep you hooked. I think. Yeah, I think uh, running along the same lines, really, that you're going to learn something no matter what age. If you watch it, you're going to either you know, learn the moral of the the moral of a story, or, um, or or about maybe making the wrong decision at some at some point in your life, um, or maybe just a few dance moves. Or, or do you want to show us a couple things? No, I'm good. I think there was one uh, that we're no, it's, Luke, it's, like, oh, it's my time. Well, that Luke did a lot better than me. I you actually so do it. Guys, well, I think you both enjoy. I think no, no, it's no, just no, one, two. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Amazing. And we're done. Really? Guys, you did not support me on that. Well, can, can, 